So know what your goals are. Decide which house you're going to open. We already talked about the strategy to do that. Go to your MLS and go find the houses that fit a great criteria. Stage the house that works for you. We're going to talk about that a little bit more and we talk about in the house. We're going to stage it, know what the house is, prepare to build those relationships and have the necessary tools. You wouldn't go to a farmer's market and just have a blank table or sit in the back. You would have a booth and tablecloths and handouts and sign-in sheets and being professional. Uh, understand what's in the neighborhood, who's in the neighborhood, the market reports for the neighborhood, listings that are in the neighborhood, just sold in the neighborhood. Be the expert, because if people are walking to that open house, there's a good chance they're going to be asking you about the neighborhood. So let's now chunk that down even further, setting some goals. How many leads, how many people, how many buyers, how many sellers, how many invitations can we get? Are you inviting people out to it? I just want you to have a plan of what makes today a success. I think so many times agents or anyone go into an activity, an event, an open house, a day of prospecting, a day of cold calling with zero expectations and zero goals and they just finish the task, yet they can't really evaluate was it successful or not. So I'm gonna encourage you, have some goals, know what you want to achieve. Ask your coach, is this, is this doable? Am I thinking too big? Am I thinking too small? If you fall short of it, let's go, what can we tweak? What can we enhance? What worked well? Let's go double that down. Yeah.